30-24, the final score here in State College as Penn State knocks off the Iowa Hawkeyes as we visit now with head coach James Franklin. And coach, gritty win, say the least. How uh, proud of you are you of this team? Yeah, gutsy win uh, against a really good team and a really good program and a, and a really good head coach. You know, so we were fortunate. Uh, didn't play, didn't play really smart in the first half, um, but we were still in the game. So we were able to go into halftime, get them settled down, get some things cleaned up. Uh, our defense played phenomenal. To think we went an entire game without giving up a traditional touchdown, you know, was significant. So, um, you know, I'm just very proud of our guys. That first half, obviously, like you said, not ideal, but you go to the break, locked up 17-17. You fought back to get to that point. What did you say to your guys in, at the break? Yeah, just, you know, listen, we just got to play smarter. We were playing really hard. We we're playing really hard and with, you know, tremendous heart, but we just didn't play smart. So let's get those things cleaned up. Let's make them earn it. Let's not beat ourselves. Um, and then to see some guys kind of step up, like Nick Scott make a huge play for us was huge. Your defensive unit, you touched on a little bit, but solid job, to say the least, by your defensive unit tonight. Our, our defense was unbelievable. Etor Matos did great things. Nick Scott did great things. Uh, we were able to really limit their running game and make them, make them one-dimensional. Uh, we were able to get some sacks against an offensive line, an offense that has given up very few sacks. So just overall, just, just an unbelievable great win. You gave away some game balls after the game, not something you normally do, but tonight was a special case. So which game balls did you give away and why? Well, I, you know, I wish I could have gave a ball away to our whole defense, and we'll probably do something in the team meeting about that tomorrow because they played unbelievable. But I just thought, you know, Trace McSorley, a guy that's, you know, done everything for this program for five years, gets hurt, comes back. You know, uh, Ricky Ronnie makes an unbelievable call versus cover zero, and he goes for 51-yard touchdown. Huge play. And I gave one to Tommy Stevens because in a day and age of college football where guys just leave, um, and do what's in their best interest. He's put his team first. He came back for his teammates, and he was able to go in and do his job, and we needed him to. You know, and then uh, the last game ball is a young man from Iowa. Jake Pinnegers made six out of his last seven field goals and was huge tonight, so uh, couldn't be more proud of him. Much appreciate your time. Nice job tonight. Once again, Penn State gets a 30-24 to victory.